We start by noting that the square of the sum of three numbers, a, b, and c, which is a plus b plus c whole square, is equal to a square plus b square plus c square plus two times in brackets a, b plus a, c plus b, c. Now let a is equal to 1 upon y minus z, b is equal to 1 upon z minus x, and c is equal to 1 upon x minus y. Substituting these values in the above equation, we get 1 upon y minus z plus 1 upon z minus x plus 1 upon x minus y whole square is equal to 1 upon y minus z square plus 1 upon z minus x square plus 1 upon x minus y square plus 2 times in brackets 1 upon y minus z times z minus x plus 1 upon y minus z times x minus y plus 1 upon z minus x times x minus y. Now let's denote the expression in the square brackets on the right hand side by t. Evaluating t separately, t is equal to 1 upon y minus z times z minus x plus 1 upon y minus z times x minus y plus 1 upon z minus x times x minus y. Taking a common denominator, y minus z times z minus x times x minus y, we get t is equal to 1 upon the common denominator times in brackets x minus y plus z minus x plus y minus z. In the square brackets, all the terms cancel and therefore the value of t is equal to 0. Substituting t is equal to 0 in the above equation, we get 1 upon y minus z plus 1 upon z minus x plus 1 upon x minus y whole square is equal to 1 upon y minus z square plus 1 upon z minus x square plus 1 upon x minus y square, which is the required result.